Hey y'all, this one is going to be super, super quick. Um, I got this on, I wrote down the 21st. I think it was the night of the 20th. Um, I think it started like on Sunday night. Was that the 20th? I don't know, but it's going to be quick. It's worth the wait. Um, I'm just here to let you know that everything that is growing between you and your kingdom spouse or anything that will grow from y'all's union, it is worth the wait, okay? And this doesn't have to be kingdom spouse specific, right? Like he'll give me the words, I understand, but then I can see how it applies to different areas in my life. Um, know that it's going to be worth the wait. And, and I pray that you have like this peace in this knowing of that fact even if you don't even have the slightest clue of what all is to come but uh if you're like me and you're prophetic right um all of god's children should have a level of prophetic gifting right but they have given you glimpses okay you might have little inklings of what it might be okay and even with that you only know part Every time I get overwhelmed by the little bit, he, God laughs at me. I remember the morning I was like, well, can you just show me a little bit? And it wasn't even just him specific. I was like, can you just show me a little bit? And I was so overwhelmed I had to get up, okay? Because I was like, oh, uh-uh. I don't, how? When? Like, And that was just the part that he showed me, right? So with that, I wrote down extended vision. So that kind of goes back to what I was just saying. Um, and waiting and having to practice patience, because that's what we're having to do, right? Um, for the full restoration, the full manifestation, whatever, the fullness of it, which even I'm talking now, like, we ain't never going to arrive. Like, it's just new phases, new levels. Like, you might be dating now, or maybe y'all are already married now, but the vision will continue to grow and expand, right? vision concerning y'all's purpose together or individual the vision concerning y'all's territory right the vision concerning y'all's household y'all's family like it's an extended vision i know for a lot of my projects i know where i am right now it's a good place to be in right now like i'm content but i also know and i can see how it will grow and how it will expand and extend for years to um come right like we were in a place where we were planting the seeds but now we're in a place where like we're we're actively working on these things we're building we're planning all of that and like i um i think i've said this in multiple videos like i got stuff that i do separate he got stuff that he do separate that's how it's gonna be but then it's gonna be y'all come together and y'all care about what each other got going on right but then you birth start to birth things together whether it's projects ministry type of things or um children right and so it's only going to grow and expand for the years to come and i just think that's a beautiful thing um let me see so i said everything growing between y'all so that would be the love the connection the bond whatever the stuff that's actually growing in between y'all because for me i tweeted it yesterday it was like in my feelings or whatever or in my lack of patience i'm like god come on like what are we waiting on come on right and then in my spiritual maturity when i'm walking with the holy spirit i'm not being led by my feelings but i'm being led by my faith it's like hey like actually i appreciate you letting me baby step this especially if it's a situation where y'all had fumbled it before you weren't good stewards of your relationship before right like he's a god of second chances thank you that you're giving us like an opportunity to take it slow to do the baby steps because it's in the baby steps where we learn these lessons okay and in learning all these new lessons that he's allowing us to prepare more right whatever it is that we need to prepare that we can pl plan more that we can strategize and um develop and just you know what did i write down? i don't want to miss it plan and strategize more um effectively for the ideas and the visions no matter where it is and again this doesn't just have to be your kingdom spouse like i said i got different stuff i've been working on and it's like i mean you could be taking me a little faster but then it's like maybe i need to appreciate the pace i'm in now because it's probably something i need to learn right now before it picks up it might not be picking up because i'm still not learning or embracing or applying the new knowledge from the lessons you get what i'm saying so we got to be thankful in that and y'all know i'm i struggle with patience tremendously right like so this is just kind of what he was telling me and then um so everything between y'all but anything that grows from y'all so the business the babies um etc okay we know there's nothing there's a lot, a lot of purpose in business ministry whatever that's going to be between you and your kingdom spouse okay um 
so maturity all of that and then the last thing i wrote down was knowledge checkpoints in the baby steps because it's like you don't want to get it and mess it up again like god has proven he's a god of second chances right and i'm gonna get this chance right like i ain't gonna make them same mistakes we're not gonna make those same mistakes so if if, it, if we gotta go so take these baby steps like that's cool right but then also we know because even i'm saying that i still feel like he gonna take us by surprise and it's still been quick right and it's like hold on wait 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 right like we'd be so impatient and then he doing it, it's like oh wait a minute so let's just try to be more mindful like i really be speaking to myself because it's worth the wait. And I pray that y'all feel like that, right? Like it's so worth the wait, no matter what it is. So to keep practicing um, our patience and just be thankful.